Hello everyone. This is the MIPS programming part 3. And today I'm going to discuss about the subroutine. So in a high level programming we know method, we know function. So these are all the same. And as in Lee language, so the function, procedure, subroutine, subprogram, method everything is subroutine okay so from the previous discussion we already learned the program template so you're gonna have the data and then the variable and this is the new thing today calling a subroutine so you name the subroutine is print okay and this gel function is this is calling the print function or subroutine okay and then you're saying exit the program here so you can think about them uh, in java the way we write the main program and then sub uh, function in this outside of the main main function so similar way this is the main and here we are exiting the program but when you uh, and the subroutine this this function is defined here okay let me let me tell you one thing when we call the jail it does two things one is jump to this address print address which is here okay and then the other thing it does at the same time it it save the next instruction address which is next instruction is this one load immediately dollar sign b010 for exit so this is the next instruction so it save address of this instruction okay and then it jump to that place this two are important so when we call the jail it jump to this address and save the address so when it's come to here it's gonna do whatever instruction here inside this function so here I said load address of the message and then I said print we know this two line from previous discussion and then after the instruction so we have to finish it we have to come back here so that's why we say jr means jump register where the return address right here so before this function has saved the address here so when you call the jr so that means jump to return address jumping to here right here so here we're saying exit so Let's see line by line how it work. Okay, I'm gonna load the program. This one. Let's check the line by line. One, two, three, four. So I'm in the main jail main function, and then second is going to the jail print. It's calling the um, subroutine. So when I call here, notice that it will jump to where we have the print. Yep. It jump to this inside the print we have the load address of message load address of message and then i have system call after system call it, it now i'm here so when i call second time it will come to the previous exit program li then and it exit <coughs> Let's run together.
Let's say hello. All right. That's it for today. Uh, next video, I'll discuss with uh, parameter passing from stack and loop. Thank you very much.